Well, new at 5.30, shotguns, rifles, ammunition, all this and more have been stolen from a Boy Scout storage facility. Tonight, sheriff's deputies are piecing together this dangerous theft. News 4's Luke Moretti spent the day in Lockport getting the latest information. Luke? Yeah, Jackie, this isn't a case of the Boy Scouts not being prepared. In fact, the guns and ammo were locked up, meaning someone went to a lot of trouble to get at them. Thieves made off with rifles, shotguns, and a bow. It's distressing to us, of course, that uh, the, the items of this nature would be out on the street. Jim McMullen, scout executive for the Iroquois Trail Council, says someone gained entry to this building in the town of Lockport. He says the guns, including ammunition used for summer camp, were taken. These items were stored in a locked uh, cabinet inside of a inside the office so they were uh, that was uh, that door was kicked in in order to gain entrance it's believed that the burglary happened sometime between august 2nd and this past monday the niagara county sheriff's office is now investigating the burglary scout officials are hoping to get back what was taken in the meantime they're very surprised by what happened here we have been in that location that uh, that service office has been there for in excess of 30 years and uh, uh, to my mind, uh, to my knowledge, there hasn't been uh, a break-in of that sort ever in that location. Jim McMullen says the current summer camp season is closed and that the theft won't have an impact right now. But he says the equipment will have to be replaced by next summer. Oh, I'm sure we'll have to jump through hoops. You know, uh, we, we don't take lightly uh, 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 firearms and firearm purchases. These are all uh, controlled events, and um, it'll, be, uh, it'll take some time. Well, in addition to the guns, about $300 worth of ammunition is now in the hands of thieves. McMullen says the kids who benefit from the programs are the ones that really get hurt when something like this happens. Luke Moretti, News 4.